Brings me to the question, uh, is it really tough being a celebrity who is always under the constant media glare or the arc lights? I think anybody who is in that space where anybody can attack you, it's difficult for them to do things normally, be it politicians, be it celebrities, be it sports personalities, anybody who has a kind of public uh, you know, viewership and people start noticing you, it gets a little difficult. We can't be so... I'm so bindas, I can get away with any. We can't. We have to be conscious about our actions, about what we say. And a lot of times it's used against us. Right. So you better be very, very careful of what you are saying. Watch your words, talk before you, you know, think before you talk and all that. And, uh, but for me it is not very difficult because I still want to do the regular things what other people do. Like go to a mall shop. Just go to a movie with my friends, go buy popcorn or walk on the street. I still want to do all that. They were like, people are like, why are you going alone? You should go with people. It's okay. It's not like people will come and attack me. Because I'm from Hyderabad, I have that sense of freedom, I think. Right. People in Hyderabad are really cool and friendly. I've never faced a situation where I'm like, oh my God, I shouldn't go alone or wear a scarf, something like that. So it didn't affect me a lot. I don't know. In Chennai, even if I walk, people are like, oh, this is that girl who's in that movie. Right. So, in Hyderabad, I can still be myself. Right, yeah. right. So, did you have to let go of anything in these past eight years after you come to the industry? I think a lot of things that I had, there was like a choice I had to make. Okay. This or that. Sometimes personally also. Sometimes things that I want to do, I had to do something different. I had to take up something different. Yeah, there have been, I would say, sacrifices to get to a stage where I am. But I don't regret making this choice because ultimately this is what I want to be. What right. you do, whatever your actions are, it's your own content. You wouldn't, nobody would push you to do it, nobody would stop you from doing it. So whatever I am, it's my conscious effort or my conscious, uh, you know, this is how I have to be, this is how I am. Right. So I don't regret losing anything. But there were times where I thought I wish I did things differently maybe a little better so in terms of your work like is that what you personally at? also okay. I'm like okay I should have handled it with a little more grace I'm a very short-tempered person yeah. I snap like that but <laughs> Thank I you, very for <laughs> <not snapping laughs> right you haven't still done no, anything no, no. but otherwise also even if I do that very instantly I'm myself people yeah. like is she okay or <laughs> is she like a split personality or bipolar <laughs> Uh, yeah, there are so many mood swings, which obviously people wouldn't know. Right. And they're like, it is psycho now, is she what? <laughs> so I'm a very loving person. Suddenly I become this, okay, what's happening kind of a thing. People what are scared. What happens to you? Like I think I take every, I'm a very sensitive person. Okay. So anything I take personally. Okay. You know, if you say something which is remotely relative also, I think he must have said something about me and I start crying and suddenly I'm like, He'll, it's that joke. I'm like, seriously, I reacted too much too, you know, soon. So, <laughs> it's like that. You can't do anything about it because some of it is true but not the entire thing, you know. They want to make up stuff all the time. Oh, that girl, I know she's like, this. it's very easy for them to say something like that. And uh, I have learned it the hard way, really hard way. From that college girl, school girl who was very bindas. All I used to think of, go shop, what can I do with this kind of money? I used to think like that. Now, I have to be careful about everything. 